I've got a brand new scanner. Inside this box is River Point's Metro X blue light laser scanner. Uh, the one that's about to launch on Kickstarter. I have in my hands here a beta unit. Why do I have a beta unit? Well, I am fortunate enough where, because of, I guess, my prolific nonstop scanning with my Morocco and my Inspire, they saw it fit to send a weirdo like me a completely new device that's leagues beyond anything I've used. So, you know, underqualified, over ranting, very excited. It's time to take it out and see what we're working with. Let's put on our unboxing gloves. Nice. Oh, box got a little bit dinged up in shipping. But that's okay. As long as what's inside of it is in good condition. Oh. What have we got in here? Ooh. We've got a hard case. Oh, a heavy hard case. Got a nice little Revo Point logo on there. That's satisfying. Nice. Let's take a look with what we've got here. Let's see what we're working with. All right, so I think that's obviously the scanner. You know, it a, seems a little bit smaller than I was expecting. I guess I was thinking something, you know, size of the range, but it's actually, even in the bag, it's dense. It feels substantial, but not heavy. Oh, look at that. That's what we're here for. That is the star of the show. Everybody say hello to the Metro X. Nice. What's that? Oh, a little hidden compartment. Oh, of course. It's not a Reva Point scanner unless it comes with a tripod. I like that carbon fiber on it. Pretty nice. Standard. I was going to say standard fare, but look at that. Oh. Pretty cool. I like that, but I don't know. I'm kind of a handheld guy half the time, so I don't know how much I'll be using this. Let's move this beautiful piece of hardware. Oh, we've got our turntable. Oh, with a power cable. Okay, so this is a dual axis turntable. You know, the other two scanners I've got are the Morocco and the Inspire, and they both came with this small turntable. So this is my first dual axis. In my head, I actually thought it was a lot smaller. I thought it was about the same size as the uh, standard turntable. I'm digging this. I like that. And then we got wires. What's this? All right, that looks like our USB. We've got three ends or two ends here. Okay. So we've got one real chunky. USB-C connector. It looks like it locks in. That makes sense. All right. We have a... Okay, and that's what the... We have a power brick. So it looks like this is going to require power when we're using it. Wow. That is a beefy power supply. But you know what? It makes sense. 
more scanner, more power. What's this? Okay, we got our international adapters. Does this work? All right, it comes with a US plug standard on it. Wouldn't be a Reva Point product without our USB C adapter. And oh my goodness, this is the smallest Agrippa statue I have seen yet. I I guess this is like the one that comes with the mini. But I haven't used any blue light scanner before. So the one that I've currently got is uh, a good deal bigger. Man, look at that. The size difference between the two of those is immediately telling me the kind of detail I can expect to pull out of this scanner. Never talk to me or my son again. You tell him, Daddy. That is cool. I am loving this case. I am loving this case. A bit. Okay. There's more. Oh, of course. We have to have a calibration board. I can get it out. Oh, good gravy that's heavy. That's a substantial amount of the weight that's in that box. Oh. Okay. We got glass. Man. Everything about this just screams premium. I mean, as somebody who started off with the Inspire, which is, I love that by no means is that a bad scanner, but this is just, this is a different league. Oh, I need to scan with it ASAP. What's that? A little piece of paper? Oh, don't look into laser beams. All right, let's protect that big glass plate. So yeah, we have got dual axis turntable, beefy tripod, USB-C adapter, the star of the show, Metro X, the tiniest Agrippa, power cables upon power cables upon USB-C cables. Man. I need to start scanning with this right away.